We are at 905 Academy in Belmont. It's 3-19-2012. Um, We're about ready to do a video from a clean out that's located here just outside the house. The crawl space door and the clean out. This goes out to the front and we'll uh, hopefully get all the way out to the main and see what our sewer looks like. We are underwater, uh, pushing down the line, can't actually see a thing. There we go, we'll get the lens plate off a little bit. So far we've just been completely underwater and uh, occasionally you can see a little light. You can't see much when we're underwater unless it's really clear water. We'll just continue. It's going in pretty easy but there must be a uh, blockage somewhere to be holding all this water back. We'll just continue down and see where we get to. At this point, we are at the main. This is the lateral that we're in. This is the lateral we're in now where you can see the water running. And as we're going this way, this is the connection onto the main. And then that's the sewer main line. You can see the water running down the main right there. We are going to pull back a little ways and run some water down the line, see if we can uh, get the line a little clearer. We may have pushed whatever blockage there was down the line. Line seems to be flowing pretty good. We're going to uh, stop the hose, let the line clear, and then uh, we'll do this video from the main line back toward the house. Okay, it looks as if the line is drained, and we're going to do this video from the main line uh, back toward the house. I'll go in and show the main line connection here. That's the main line connection. And then as we come back, we're going backwards toward the house. Line looks pretty clear. We're coming back toward the house. Here now we can see it is clay pipe and we do have quite a few roots. That was undoubtedly where our backup was being created. And here we're coming backwards, another coupling where there is a lot of roots and you can see a lot of grease and muck build up. So this line has definitely got some issues. Clay pipe has joints about every three feet. You can see there now we're going back under the water. I'm going to go forward, see if I can push this through, get it to drain a little bit. Once we poke a hole through some of these roots, the water will start going out. And we're coming back toward the house again. Of course, here we're going a little bit back underwater. Line is still holding some water. I'm totally underwater now. Coming back toward the house. Hard to tell. What we have seen is that there are joints with roots in it. And I suspect that it's clay pipe all the way back toward the house. We've got about uh, 40 feet from where the cleanout is out to the roadway. Line is in the center of the roadway. 
homeowner is responsible for the entire line in Belmont all the way up to the main line connection. We are still holding water uh, pretty deep and it's covering up the whole camera and it's not draining out so undoubtedly we have a little negative grade situation and a uh, root issue here. coming backwards toward the house, going to be coming out of the clean out uh, on the side yard here in a minute. coming out of the clean out that's on the side yard and uh, there's the uh, crawl space access door and here's the clean out that we're going into we're going to push in one more time maybe there's a chance we can clear that line a little bit and get some of that water to go out We're at a point where we're going to call this end of video. We went back in the line, tried to push it clear to the main, and we're just totally underwater for most of the line from the clean out at the house uh, to probably just about the property fence line. And uh, then the line uh, begins to achieve some grade out to the main. But every joint that we see has roots in it all the way out. We're going to call this end of video.